I got you a present. Actually, I made you a present. January 2024, for whatever reason, has been such a great month on this channel. So many people have enrolled in Final Cut Rockstar, which I don't know what's going on, but I'm just so thrilled about it. And I love hearing from everyone how much they're learning and how much they loved it. And so I was thinking, what can I do to show my appreciation and also teach you something at the same time? So here is what I came up with. Have you ever created a short form video here in Final Cut Pro and then uploaded it to YouTube or Instagram Reels or TikTok and you notice that all of those overlays are in the way of the work that you did? I created these transparent graphics that mock the overlays on all of those social media platforms so so when you're creating vertical videos in Final Cut Pro, you can make sure that all of your elements are title safe. You're going to be able to download these for free at jenjagger.com. But before we do that, let me show you how to bring them into your Final Cut app so you can access them forever. So this is a typical vertical video here in Final Cut Pro. I've got all these B-roll shots and I do have some text overlays as well but I wanna make sure that all of these text overlays and all these parts of my shots are gonna look good on every social media platform. So what we need to do is add what's called a custom overlay. That's where these graphics are gonna download from jenjagger.com come into play. Just head up to the top of your viewer to the view menu, drop down and hover over choose custom overlay and then navigate to add custom overlay then a finder window is going to pop up and you just need to navigate to the social overlays you're gonna download from my website and you can only import one at a time. Let's start with that YouTube shorts overlay and I'm going to select open and now you're gonna see a mock-up of all the icons and text that the app is going to overlay on our video when we upload it. In addition, you'll see this blue border this blue border indicates what's actually going to be visible when someone watches your video on an iPhone because the iPhone crops off the sides of vertical videos. So now if I just like look at these text overlays, I can see that they're kind of out of bounds here. So I might wanna go ahead and resize them so they're within the blue border. Now, when I go to share this video, this custom overlay will not be visible on the exported video file. Let's import those two other graphic overlays as well. And now that I've imported them, when I go to the view menu, I can select choose custom overlay and you'll see that my overlays are now saved and I can switch between them super easily. Once I import these custom overlays into a Final Cut library, they will be available to me in the same way for any library I create in the future or any library I open that I created in the past. So I hope you find these graphic overlays helpful if you make social media content. Again, you can download them at jenjager.com. I will link to it down below. Thanks for all your support so far in 2024. I picked out some other videos for you guys. I'll see you again.